Welcome. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. You're listening to MWAMH, Mom. And I'm your host, Mark Wild. We're here to uh, talk today about a very interesting and trending topic, Tinder. Some of you may have heard of it. Some of you may not have. Some of you lonely, lonely birds out there may need it. For those of you who don't know about Tinder, it's a uh, mobile application, a dating application. Goes right on your phone. That's what a mobile app is. Anyway, it connects you with possible people, prospects, if you will, to date. So the way the app works is uh, you get, uh, uh, you put a picture of yourself and a brief little description of yourself, a bio if you will, and what and who it is that you're looking for. Uh, There are people who um, don't really uh, use the app right, abusers, if you will. Some are only there for hookups, but we're not here to talk about the hookups today. No, no, no. Today we are here to talk about love, L-O-V-E, folks. And uh, we're here to understand how the app works. How does it match lovers to lovers? Um, We want to know what the purpose of the app is. So, you uh, put a picture of yourself, and other people put pictures of themselves, and then you have the option, 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 options. You can either swipe or hit like. If you hit like and another person has hit like on you, you get a notification and then you can start talking to each other directly. That's right, folks. Direct message. Slide into those DMs. So yeah, you can uh, message each other directly. You can even unlike someone's pictures if you want. That's right, folks. Unlike. Change your mind. Burn. I'm not sure if um, that's true. Can uh, can you unlike someone's picture? I'm not sure. We will research that and we will get back to you on this. I'm, uh, you know, sometimes on Tinder, people pretend that they look a certain way and they don't. And that can be very frustrating, but we're not here to talk about that. Sometimes people, uh, they uh, don't show up even when you um, send them a message over and over. Where are you? I'm waiting. They don't show up, but uh, we're not here to talk about that either. Uh, Anyway, folks, uh, we're just going to take a short little break, and uh, we'll be right back to take some calls from you, the listeners, the uh, thriving audience, if you will, um, just after this short break and a word from our sponsors. Cafe Vino is really delicious. I don't think I could get through this interview awake without it. Not to plug our sponsors. This is in, by no means a commercial. It's an odd advertisement. Anyway, we are back. For those of you signing on, just signing on in your cars or from your homes, what we're doing here today is we're here to get a feel from the listeners about how they feel. We're feeling how they feel when they use the app of Tinder. Does it work for them? Are you finding L-O-V-E love? Are you finding marriage? Are you finding your special someone? Are you just in it to have one good night, you know? With that one right guy or gal or guy and guy or gal and gal, whatever. What are you in it for? These are the questions I want to ask. Those are the answers I am looking for. I want to touch upon these in your calls today when you call because you will call. Do people show up on your dates? Are people hitting like on your pictures? Are you getting enough matches? Can you unlike people's pictures? I really want to know that one. Do people send you inappropriate messages that their older brothers are going to come and beat you up because they know where you live? (laughs) But we're not talking about that today. We're talking about you, the listeners and viewers. 
And uh, I just want to know what the listeners have to say. And we are not here to talk about Kelly Bishop. Are you listening, Kelly? We're not here to talk about you, Kelly. Kelly Bishop, fake picture, no show, brother tattling Kelly. (gasps) Kelly knows who she is. You know who you are, Kelly. Heart-crushing monster of a whore, Kelly. Blocked me on Facebook, Kelly. Told all the women at the Humane Society about my dick pic, Kelly. Can't handle all of my creepy fetishes, Kelly. That, Kelly, you know who you are, Kelly. Well, I'm done, Kelly. You didn't have to send me a restraining order. I'm over you. And, Kelly, I wasn't even going to call you, so I don't know why you included that. And don't even think about me thinking about calling you, because we're over, Kelly. I never even loved you anyway, Kelly. Um, anyway, uh, I'm sorry, folks. Uh, yeah, got, um, that's about all the time we have for today, folks. This is Mark Wild with M W A M H Mwam Mark Wild A M Ha, and we're back tomorrow night at six p.m. And I promise you, we're gonna take those calls and answer these questions, not you, Kelly. And this is Mark Wild, Wild and Out. Mom, what the fuck? Oh, sweetie, I just wanted to see if you were hungry. Well, I'm not. Well, I, I thought you would be. You yeah, just, well, why hey. did you think that? Because I'm not. Like, if I was hungry, I would have told you I was hungry. Sweetie, I hear these weird things being said in here. I don't understand. Well, why are you this. listening? Well, I hear you screaming dick pic. What's oh my a dick God. pic? Well, it's when, like, someone sends you, like, a picture of their, like, their dick. That is absolutely disgusting. I know, it's disgusting. There are people doing that. They do that. I don't do that. Like, I'm not doing that. I don't get those. Who who is this Kelly Prince? Kelly Bishop. It's Kelly Bishop. She's a character I created for my brain. I don't understand. She's a character, Mom. I told you I'm doing Rough Cat today. She's not real. She's made up. But why? Because she's part of, like, the, the joke of the video. I don't understand. Yeah, well, you're not supposed to understand. You're not, like, you're not in it. But, Kalia, what? Why are you dressed like this? It's like, cause, uh, it's like a character. I'm, Mom, obviously, like, I don't have facial hair. Like, it's a character. Yeah, sweetie, I'm like a character. Sweetie. His name is Mark, and he does a uh, radio show. Listen, I thought you would be hungry. Do you want something to eat or not? No, I said no already. I'm okay. not hungry. Okay. Oh, my God, you ruined it. There's my beautiful girl. Whatever. Don't always interrupting my videos.